Good evening. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Good evening. Good to see you. I'm really happy good to evening. see you on Friday, right? Hello, Ellen Nilsson, Edwin, good, good evening. evening. Good evening. Jessica, good evening. Uh, Luis, good evening. We have Fatima, good evening. Teacher, uh, una, una situación ahorita. Tell me, Ellen Nilsson. Uh, como yo tengo un negocio y un empleado no me vino ahora, voy a tener así como desconectado entre... No está conectando así a cada rato el audio, igual la cámara. Ok. Entonces, okay. Pero ahí va a estar atento de la, de la clase. Ok, no, Ellen Nilsson. No. Ok, thank you. Por si no responde y me pregunta, ¿verdad? Yeah, it's all right. Okay. Ok, thank you. You're welcome. Jennifer, hello. Good evening. Igual yo, teacher, voy, de, voy en camino todavía. Este, voy a estar aquí en el audio en silencio. Y igual no, no puedo encender la cámara porque voy en camino. Oh, okay, okay. We hope you get you come home um, well. Buenas noches, saludos a todos. Este, solo una pregunta. El día de ayer no no hubieron clases porque me conecté, pero no no hubo. Uh, yeah, Luis, we we were in class. Sí, estuvimos en clase, Luis. Las clases son de lunes a viernes. De 8 a 10 de la noche. A lo mejor algo, uh, hubo alguna falla ahí con, de conexión o algo, pero sí, sí estuvimos acá. Mm, sí, porque bien raro. Me conecté y solo habían como dos o tres conectados. Entonces, bueno, pasé hasta como las nueve conectado y nada, solo los mismos dos. Después solo yo estaba conectado según el Zoom. Ajá. Mm, qué curioso. Sí, porque este, de hecho... Este sí, toda la semana hemos estado conectados, Luis. Sí, ajá, eso le estaba comentando yo a la licenciada. Y los dos días anteriores no había estado eh, presente porque estaba en labores, estaba saliendo bien noche. Y ahora, pues, bueno, y ayer y hoy me tocó libre. Por eso es que eh, entré ayer, igual, no, sorpresa, por eso le digo, bien raro, porque solo dos aparecíamos conectados. Bueno, pero este, lo, lo bueno es que tenemos este, las clases grabadas, ahí están en la plataforma. Usted las puede consultar, puede este, verificar las actividades que hemos hecho y pues para ponerse como, como este, actualizarse con, la, con las actividades que hemos estado realizando. Ok, muchas gracias. Ok. Bueno, well, it's a... It's eight o'clock, right? So uh, two minutes after eight, so it's time to start. Okay, well, I, I know that you have a, an activity for tonight. And just I will let I will let Luis Reyes to know about this activity because he didn't get into the class yesterday. Luis, eh, voy a empezar a preguntarle a los demás acerca de la tarea de ayer. En todo lo que yo pregunto a ellos, usted busca información de tres profesiones. Tres profesiones que no hayamos visto en clase, ¿ok? Y al final, pues, le voy a pedir que, que comparta la información que usted obtuvo. Eh, tres profesiones, ¿en qué sentido, perdón? Que... Eh, ¿Qué es lo que hace, digamos, eh, un docente? ¿A qué se dedica? ¿Cuáles son sus actividades? Eh, podría ser este, un ejemplo, ¿verdad? ¿Qué es lo que hace un ingeniero? ¿Cuáles son las tareas que hace un ingeniero? Listo. Ok, pero necesito tres, tres, tres profesiones, ok? Listo. Ok, yes, all right. So we're going to start. Uh, good evening, people. I can see Jennifer. I can see Wendy. I can see Henry. I can see Carla over here. Ok, welcome to the class. So we're going to start with the activities as soon as possible. Remember that we have 120 minutes to work tonight. And it is... Good night. Hello, Carla. Good hello. evening. Hello, hello. Good evening. So it's quite important uh, for us to take advantage of time. Okay, so tonight I want everybody to participate. You know, tonight it's an opportunity to um, 
to investigate about vocabulary, to talk about different um, professions, occupations, um, et cetera. So that, that means that we're going to have a, um, a great time sharing information, okay? Tonight is a, a class in which we are going to try to grasp a lot of vocabulary, okay? To, we need to get a lot of vocabulary, practice a lot of vocabulary so that we can uh, enrich um, our, our repertoire of words. Uh, uh, let me see, we're going to start with, let me see how we check here. Well, we're gonna start with the three, with the activities I assigned yesterday, the homework, right? So I will start with Carla Mendoza. Hello, Carla. How are Hello, you doing? Teacher. Hello. Did you yes. investigate um, information about three professions? Yes. Yeah. Which are them? Three professions. Um, occupations or professions, occupation. right? Yes, 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 yes. Yes. A lawyer. Okay. Um, a, a lawyer. A lawyer. Architect and my profession design graphic designer a graphic designer so we have three uh, professions there right what can yes. you tell us about them well the the law the lawyer lawyer is the people uh, that is a professional that advise guides and represent his client in legal matters they work in legal firm or company and especially specialize in the in the specific area. ¿Cómo se dice area? Area. Area, that's right. Area. Uh, he he's work independent or a, or or in a company. Uh, he needs to read more so much books. To... <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, architect is, is a, a professional that design houses, buildings, and create public spaces. His work involves collaborator, collaborators, such as civil engineers, construction work, Girls and interior designer and graphic designer. Um, they are a visual, a visual communication communicator of a message or an idea. They create art with an an aesthetic style. That company that company request. Uh, create a uh, position brands, uh, produce and reproduce art in all kinds of printed or digital material. That's all. Digital <laughs> material, that's fantastic, Carla, great information. So mm -hmm. what is the activity we're gonna start working with tonight? Well, uh, Carla mentioned uh, three um, professions, right? Which were them? Vamos a ir haciendo nuestro propio banco de datos, ¿ok? Carla mencionó tres profesiones, ¿verdad? ¿Cuáles fueron? Lawyer. Lawyer. lawyer diseño gráfico. Lawyer, graphic designer. Graphic design. And what was the, 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 the last one? Arquitecto. Architect, <laughs> right? So ahora de esas tres, de esas tres, Si usted ya las tiene en su banco de datos, en la tarea que usted ya hizo, entonces ya no las escribe. Si no las tiene, Carla nos va a ayudar con, uh, con, la, con la información en el chat. ¿Ok? Carla, sí. ¿no la tiene de manera digital, Carla? ¿La información? Sí, 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 la tengo también de manera digital. Ok, entonces vamos a ir haciendo nuestro banco de datos en un documento Word. ¿Ok? Y lo vamos a ir completando. Si usted ya tiene esas tres profesiones, entonces, pues hace caso omiso y pues no las copia. 
Si no, las, los demás. si no las tiene, entonces sí las copia, ¿ok? Y la vamos a ir compartiendo en el chat, ¿ok? Lo más significativo de cada, de cada profesión la vamos a ir compartiendo, ¿ok? Uh -huh, uh -huh. Vaya, ahora Carlos nos ayuda Carla a través del chat, ¿ok? Ok, ahorita, ahorita. Ok. Now, meanwhile, Carla is working. Mientras Carla está trabajando en eso, Edwin nos va a ayudar con la presentación de él, ¿ok? ¿Cuál es, es la meta de ahora, jóvenes? Es una presentación en PowerPoint, no hay problema. Oh, ok, it's all right. It's, está, está bien, ¿verdad? Eh, la cosa es que vayamos haciendo nuestro álbum. De ahí van a ir recogiendo entonces ustedes la información de esa PowerPoint. Eh, sería la que presenté, teacher, en PowerPoint. No, tre, la, tres diferentes. Para este día eran tres profesiones diferentes. Sí, quizás voy a quedar mal porque no, no, no puse mucha atención en eso. No, no, no va a quedar mal. Le voy a dar tiempo, ¿ok? Va a ser okay. de los últimos. Ok, okay dedíquese a eso. Ok. Jennifer Hernández, go ahead. Eh, creo que no había entendido muy bien y se quedé de lo, de lo que uno hace a diario. Ok. Es... A tiempo lo, las hago ahorita, porque yo saqué de, de lo que yo hago en el día, digamos, okay. de, de lo que trabajo. Okay. I need three occupations, pueden ser tres ocupaciones o tres profesiones. Si aún no ha ah. terminado, entonces tome ese su tiempo, vamos a continuar con alguien más. Pero eh, sí debo... My occupation is cashier. Y en... Later, um, so customer service... Um, también cobro pero, pero vendo sales uh, de eso es lo que yo saqué <ríe> un poco oh, ok ok Jennifer ok de eso necesitamos que nos comparta ok esperemos que Carla eh, coloque la información y ya luego después de Carla con... en el whatsapp ah ok en el whatsapp del grupo porque si lo quieren compartir ahí, pues háganlo por ese medio. La cosa es que al final yo les voy a pedir a algunos que me compartan el documento Word, en donde han estado recopilando la información que los demás han estado compartiendo. ¿Ok? Work. Ok, so Jennifer, go ahead with the information you got, please. My information is that uh, I am cashier. Um, in customer service and sales, sales. Um, Solamente es. Okay, Jennifer. Now, if you didn't get as much information about the professions, you can look for the information now. Puede buscar ahorita información, ¿ok? Mientras los demás están este, exponiendo. Ya cuando tenga la información, la comparte, ¿ok? Acuérdense, al final voy a pedir a algunos de ustedes que nos compartan el documento Word que están trabajando. And let me see. Fátima Molina. Hello, Fátima. Buenas noches. Ese, dicho yo, yo no tengo lo de las profesiones porque creo que fue el día de ayer que dejaron esa tarea y no estuve en la sesión del día de ayer. Pero si me da un momento, ¿verdad? Eh, pues termino la presentación y, 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 y lo hago. Oh, ok, ok, Fátima. Go ahead. Este, nada, más, nada más una pregunta, teacher. Este, no. Prácticamente yo me voy incorporando, no sé en qué nivel van, eh, me siento como un poco perdido. Eh, este, y otra cosa, yo estoy conectado desde mi teléfono, no, no tengo computadora donde, donde realizar PowerPoint ni, ni nada por el estilo, por el momento. Ah, ah, ok, Luis, no, don't worry. Lo que estamos haciendo, Luis, este es un nivel básico. Ok, lo que estamos tratando en esta noche es 
recopilar cuánto vocabulario sea posible referente a las profesiones y las ocupaciones. Eso es todo por, por esta noche. Vamos a tener algunos este, ejercicios, vamos a, vamos a hacer algunos ejercicios del libro, ¿ok? Vamos a tener un listening por ahí, y, pero eh, el, el centro de, de atención de esta noche es vocabulario, ¿ok? Y que podamos de alguna manera expresar. All right, so let me see. Now, I, I don't know if there is anybody uh, ready. Let me see. Fatima Henry. Henry Giovanni. Okay, teacher. Okay, Henry. Uh, solo que, perdón, eh, hay varias palabras que ni idea, pero yo tengo administrador, um, contador y abogado. So in, in, the, in that case, you're, you're not going to take it the, into consideration, I, I mean, uh, Carla's information, because Carla uh, presented info about a lawyer also, right? Yeah. Okay. Entonces, counter, uh, keep com company account, perform accounting action, work as accounting administrator, War as auditor, no sé cómo, ni idea. <laughs> ok, investigate it, Henry. Ok. <laughs> eh, y de administrador solo tenía que es lead, dirigir, y manage, manage, que es como administra, administrador. Ok. Okay, get, do me the favor to share the information in the chat, Henry. The information okay. you got, so okay. that everybody can have an idea about what, what you investigated, please. Okay, you have Henry, we have, uh, I don't know, Jennifer Guadalupe. Eh, perdón, teacher, ahorita estoy buscando información porque no me recordaba sobre esa tarea. Ah, ok. Lady Cecibel, then. Good night. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Um, the first person is made in security. And order in public place, enforce laws and protects citizens and their property from dangers and criminal acts. Second person is um, dentist is responsible for the prevention, diagnosis, and treatment of oral disease, such as a lawyer is a three person, is responsible for advising, getting, and representing his clients in legal matters. That's all. Thank you. Great info. Great, great pronunciation, uh, lady. Thank Ladies. You. Great info. Great pronunciation. Um, Obed. Good evening, Obed. Are you there? Okay, let us try with Wendy. Wendy, are you there? Good evening. Good evening. Hello. Hello. Now, 
Could you please share the information you got about the three professions or occupations? First, my occupation is a cashier. I am chairs, sex, and schedule burials. The second, tailor and dressmaker, specialized in producing made leisure garments. The duties include discussing with customers on the type of garment to be made, measuring customer and fitting garment, coding fab fabric and assembling garment parts, making garment a style change, sewing and repairing tailor clothing. And the third is a mechanic is responsible for spending and repairing vehicles, machinery, and light trucks. Also, now a service technician, this professional oversee, maintenance, inspection, monitor, inventory, assemble. Ay, esa palabra, no sé cómo se pronuncia, pero dice mechanical, no sé cómo, cómo se pronuncia. Right, um, Me mechanical. Mechanical components and perform repair. They usually work in garage that are indoors. Yes. Okay, perfect. Quite good, Wendy. Thank you. Okay, let me see. Jessica uh, Ramos. Uh, oh, well, I remember Jessica is just commuting to her home. What about Gabriela Guardado? Hello, Gabriela. Good evening. Nice. Hello. Eh, es el cuento. Oh. No, this is about the, the three the three professions and occupations. Ah, okay. Eh, my name is Gabriela Guardado. I am uh, I am commercial analyst. Uh, but the functions is a process admins the display of the supermarket and Walmart. In verifications is document. Um, Now let us do something people it's because maybe uh, you were thinking to, uh, more about the story rather than the three professions creo que algunos de ustedes se enfocaron más en, en crear el cuento o en buscar el cuento que en la, lo de las profesiones verdad entonces Este, hagamos una cosa. Como veo que creo que eh, creo y entiendo que están mejor preparados con lo del cuento, entonces pues no, voy a pedirle solo a cinco personas que nos compartan el, el, la historia, el cuento. Y lo de las tres profesiones va a quedar como, como siempre como tarea. Es decir, si nosotros ahorita somos 15 estudiantes, y necesitamos tres uh, profesiones o ocupaciones por persona, quiere decir que al final vamos a tener un documento con la información de 45. De 45 ocupaciones o profesiones. Eh, lo bonito es que ustedes nada más van a ir copiando, pegando la información del, de la, que el otro compañero obtuvo. ¿Verdad? O sea, no, no van a invertir mucho tiempo en eso, pero sí van a tener la información y la van a tener 
para este, leerla, para es, escudriñar qué es lo que dice ahí, palabras nuevas, etc. ¿Ok? So, in order to, to take advantage of time, voy a pedir solo cinco, bueno, y voy a pedir voluntarios, ¿ok? Ya no, ya no voy a estar llamando así de la lista, en orden. Okay, I need five volunteers, ¿ok? Después de esos cinco voluntarios, vamos a continuar con la clase, ¿ok? I need five volunteers with a story, with a short story. Okay, thank you, Wendy, Wendy. Now Wendy's ready, right? Okay, now my next story is a wolf from great difficulty to get and the sheep away to the beginning of the shipper and his dog. But one day it found the scene of a ship that had been prior and throw or say. So he put it on over it, on pale and stroll down among the ship. The lamb that belonged to the ship whose skin the wall was green began to follow the wall in the ship floating. So leaving the lamb a little apart, he soon made a meal of fear and for some time he to set set in deciding the ship and enjoying filthy meal. Okay, Wendy. That was very short, right? That's what I was. That, that's what I want you to 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 look for, right? Uh, okay. Did you take advantage of it? Investigó pronunciación, vocabulario. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah. so if you did it, si lo hizo, que okay, yo sé que si lo hizo, quiere decir que ahí ganó mucho. Okay. Ganó pronunciación, ganó eh, vocabulario, y aparte de eso, ent entendió el cuento al 100%. Okay. Thank you, Wendy. First participant. Second participant. Second volunteer. Second, I need five. Teacher. Hello, Carlos. Uh, I talk about the ugly duckling. All right, the ugly duckling. Uh, okay, <laughs> patito feo. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> the mother dog sent her age to the hatch. One morning, the age belonged to crack. Five pretty sheep come out of their shell, but on her age had more hatchet. So mother dog sat down to wait then the age final fracking out come a shit with only father the shit was the clean it was beautiful beautiful swam swam when it right up that's it Thank you very much, Carlos. Okay. okay. I could notice that you encounter uh, possessive adjectives in your study, right? That was one of the objectives for the homework assignment. And also, I hope that you could, could have learned more vocabulary as well. Thank you, Carlos. Well, we have two participants uh, who already participated. Now, I need three more. Three participants more, and it will be done. Third Let participant. Yeah. Third participant, please. Third okay. participant. Hello, teacher. Okay, ladies, go ahead. Uh, talking about the little Vanessa. Um, Vanessa is a healthy girl. She eats a lot of vegetables. They give her beam 
and figure. A vendor brings fresh vegetables for the for her family. That's all. Okay, it says vegetable for her family. That was it. Okay, thank you, lady. That was really nice of you. Now, that was the third participant. I need two participants more so that we can continue with the class. Thank you. Thank you, ladies. Hello, teacher. Hello, Carla. <laughs> Yo hice mi tarea, investigué también sobre un, este, es como una conversación, como un cuento tipo conversación entre dos personas. Bueno, bueno. It's about Clara conversation with a strange, stranger man. Uh, and say, 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 say there. Uh, Clara had gone down to get some air. She needed to be alone for a wheel. Do it to the harsh comment that her boss had made. She, no, the shine of tears surfaced in her eyes. Suddenly an elderly man was sitting next, next to him. After a few moments of silence, the man asked, is not being your best day? No, the truth. I have better days, say Clara. Can you tell me, say the man? Clara had hesitated. She was before an absolute stranger. However, his serene look and something in his expression motivated her to speak. That's all. He was motivating her to speak. Okay. Hey, really nice because you could. Uh, I can. I can see you. You took into consideration the the goal of the homework, right? That was to identify the possessive adjective. Thank you, Carla. Okay. And and the last participant. The last participant for tonight. Hola. Okay. The last participant. With the story. I need one person more, one participant more. Teacher. Uh, Henry. Yo hice algo bien sencillo, solo como para <laughs> ir conociendo un poquito los los cómo se llama adjective poses posible y lo hice así my house is small we live together as as a fam family my niece Nicole has a cat her has a cat her eyes are blue blue or our house <laughs> It's beautiful. It's it's window fake a beautiful volcano. Its doors are metallic and its color is green. Excellent. Pretty good. Excellent. That was really nice. Okay, now now let us get down to business about the activities we have uh, we have for tonight, okay? Al final, si, si todavía nos queda un espacio por ahí, pues si alguien más quiere compartir la historia o algo que ha investigado, va a estar súper bien. ¿Ok? And now, let, let us go over the activity tonight. Hey, le voy a dictar algunas palabras. ¿Ok? Lo pueden hacer, pueden digitarlo o pueden escribirlo. Quiero ver qué que tanto, qué tanto nos acordamos de algunas, de algunas palabras que hemos eh, visto en clase. Ok, let me know when you get, when you get ready.
Are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. So I hope everybody is ready now. Okay, first word, la primera palabra, chef. Si alguien quiere usar el chat, úsenlo. También lo pueden hacer ahí. O sea, chef. C-H-E-F. Yeah, yeah. C-H-E-F. That's right. Second word. Esa está cortita. Okay. Hey, Pro... Esa, ¿cómo, cómo, ¿cómo es el escrito? Uh, uh, chef, chef. Chef. Yeah, C-H-E-F. Okay, number two, professor. P R O F E S O R. It's with double S, professor, double S. S. Yeah, double, double S. Uh Ah, okay. Hey, number three. Number three, accountant. Accountant. Number three, accountant. Okay. Number four, police officer. Police officer. Number five, tour guide. Tour guide. Tour guide. Tour guide. Okay, number six. Sales associate. Sales associate. Sales associate. So, number seven. Bus driver. Bus driver. Number, okay, bus driver, number seven, bus driver. Number eight, server. Server. Number nine, Mechanic. Mechanic. Uh, mechanic nine. is, yeah, number nine. And the last one, this is the last one. Number 10, flight attendant. Flight attendant. Flight. Flight attendant. No sé si se escribe así. Yeah, that's right, Carla. That's the way it is. Okay. Now, did you get the words? Now, we, we got, I will share something with you, okay? Well, I, I just want you to, to get familiarized with the vocabulary because we are going to have a listening a pre-listening exercise, okay? I mean, a listening activity. Uh, there are some common topics of conversation centers around the work, and people often might ask us about our jobs, including specific details on what we do. Okay, that's what we are trying to do tonight, right? To get information, vocabulary about uh, our wow. job in our task, in, a, in our job, etc. We're gonna listen to a recording 
and you will hear a man talking about a job. Uh, over here, we have different uh, exercises. And uh, you need to you need to, ch to choose only what? Think about the answer, then you tell me the answer, okay? We're gonna listen to it first, then we're going to develop this activity. Are you ready? Now, if you want to take notes, if you want to take notes, you can do it. De lo que escuchen, pueden tomar apuntes, lo que usted eh, desee. Eh, si escucha palabras familiares, que, usted, que son familiares para usted, escríbalas, cualquier idea, las puede hacer. Okay, here we go. Number one. He really enjoys preparing food at the Italian restaurant. Okay, what is what is what what is the activity? Chef. Uh, okay, so chef. Okay, so chef. Uh, think chef about it, right? Well, Van, Van Taylor, Hoster, chef. You will tell me. You will tell me at the end. I will play. The, I will play the second time. In in this during the second time, you will tell me what the answer is. Okay. Muy grande. Oh. Number two, my father teaches math at a university in our hometown. He sure. Professor. Three, I now work downtown at a bank using software programs to manage their financial records. Account. Account. Four. She carries a gun for protection as part of her job. Police officers. Number five. The man will explain all of the historical sites on your trip. Burger. Sunday. Number six. Maria works at a clothing store helping customers find what they need. Customer service. Customer. Sales. 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 Number Sales. seven. He'll stop near the next light and you can get off there. He'll stop at the next light and you can get off there. Bus driver. Number eight. The woman took my order, but the food hasn't come yet. Server. Number nine. The man said that my car wouldn't be ready until tomorrow because he hasn't finished repairing the problem. A mechanic. Mechanic. Number 10. My sister enjoys working for the airlines, but traveling so much and assisting passengers all day on long flights can be tiring. All right. All right. Now, yes, right. some of you were like recognizing the, the, the profession or the occupation. Okay, now I will play it the second time. And then you will tell me what is the occupation uh, that's referred in the only, okay? Number one, he really enjoys preparing food at the Italian restaurant. Uh-huh, what is the answer? Chef. Uh, we're talking about a chef. Pretty good. Let's go over the next one. The second one is about my father, uh, the professor. therapist, firefighter, or professor. We're, we're, we're going to listen first. Number two, my father teaches math at a university in our hometown. 
Okay, so my father is teacher. a, teacher. a teacher. therapist, a firefighter, and a professor. Professor. Ah, so it's a professor, right? Professor. Professor. Okay, number three. I now work downtown. What's the meaning of this word? People, so, acuérdense lo que hablamos ayer. Cualquier palabra que no reconozcamos hay que investigar, okay? I now work downtown. Okay, let's listen. Number three. Number three. I now work downtown at a bank using software programs to manage their financial records. All right, number three, it's talking about the manager, a software programmer. Software programmer. Software programmer. A software programmer? Yeah. A manager. A manager, software programmer. Hey, do you want to listen to it again? Listen, listen carefully, please. Number three. I now work downtown at a bank using software programs to manage their financial records. All right. Say manager, software programmer, or accountant? Software programmer. It says software programmer. Okay. No. It says oh, downtown at a bank using software, right? Oh, it's about a, an accountant, right? Oh, the accountant. Yeah, it's, it's, accountant. it's somebody who works at a bank. Right? At a bank. Using software accountant. programs, right? Uh, to manage. Over here is the key, right? To manage their financial records. Financial. Over here is the key, right? That is the key to get the answer, right? Accountant. Number four. Well, number four says she carries a truck driver, landscaper, or police officer part of their job. Number four. Number four. She carries a gun for protection as part of her job. And she carries a what? <laughs> Police officer. All oh, right. Police officer. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of dangerous to 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 carry a gun, right? Okay, number number five. They might well explain. Teacher, tour guide, or travel agent. That's number four. Number five, right? Here we go. Number five. The man will explain all of the historical sites on your trip. Okay. It's talking about a trip, right? I think that is the key over here. Guide. Tour a, guide. A tour guide. Okay, now yes, we did it. Maria works works at sales uh, associate, secretary, or telemarketer. What they need. Okay, so that's number six, right? Number six, Maria works at a clothing store helping customers find what they need. Okay, helping customers to find what they need. Oh, that was number six, right? Okay, what's her job, people? Secretary? A sales associate? Sales Number one. Sales association. Okay, someone mentioned a secretary, but I, I don't think it's a secretary. 
Okay, let's see. Number one. It's the number, the first one, right? All right. Maria works at a clothing store. Okay. okay. That's why, well, it doesn't make sense to be like a, a secretary uh, helping people to find what they need, right? That's a, a task for a, for a sales associate. Number seven. We have hotel clerk, bus driver, electrician. Number seven. I think that's the last one, right? Oh, no, we have 10. Yeah, we have 10. So number seven, keep it in mind. Number seven. He'll stop near the next light, and you can get off there. What's going on there? Hotel break, but cleric, bus driver, or electrician? Bus driver. Bus driver? Yes. Bus driver. All right. He'll stop near the next light. Bus driver. Yeah, you can get off there. If you can say bus driver or bus operator, it's the same person, right? Same activity. Number eight, server, hoster, dishwasher. <clears throat> Number eight, we're almost done. He'll stop at the next light and you can get off there. That's the bus driver, right? Number eight. Number eight. The woman took my order, but the food hasn't come yet. That lady or the woman took my order, but the food hasn't come yet. Hotel Craig. No, 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 that's, that's not it. This is the one. A server, server. host, or, wash, or dishwasher. Server. 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 All right, very good. Number nine. We have three options, taxi driver, sales manager, or mechanic. Let's go over it. Number nine, the man said that my car wouldn't be ready until tomorrow because he hasn't finished repairing the problem. That was very easy, right? Number nine. Mechanic. Oh. Mechanic. All right. The man said that my car wouldn't be ready until tomorrow because he hasn't finished repairing the problem. And the last one, we finally got it. Well, the last one is about about a flight attendant, pilot, or a ticket agent. Okay. Number 10. My sister enjoys working for the airlines. But traveling so much and assisting passengers all day on long flights can be tiring. What is the what is the option? The right option. Pilot. A, a pilot or a flight attendant or a ticket agent. Okay, you don't have it that clear? Flight attendant. It's a flight attendant. Okay, a flight attendant. Let's see if it was a flight attendant. Good. My sister enjoys working for the airlines, but traveling so much and assisting passengers all day on long flights can be tiring. That's a flight attendant. See, we have nine answers, correct? 
we, not, we got nine correct answers and that was really nice, okay? <clears throat> now, uh, as you can see, we have uh, some other, I mean, some other um, profession. So in occupation, we have a, a taxi driver, okay? We have a farmer, we have a web, website designer, we have a pilot, we have a doctor, we have a nurse, and we have a journalist, right? And over here we have a, the listening script, okay? Uh, I will play, you know, I will play the track again, and then you pay special attention on the pronunciation of the words. Voy a poner, voy a poner otra vez el, el track, el, el audio, Y ustedes lo van leyendo uh, y lo van escuchando al mismo tiempo. Cuando lleguemos a la 10, yo voy a pedir a 10 de ustedes que me lean, si es posible, exactamente como lo ha hecho la persona en el audio. ¿Ok? ¿Ok, people? Ok, ok. Bye. Ok, ok. Ok. All right. Okay, first one. Oops, está bien lejos. Let's see. Number one. He really enjoys preparing food at the Italian restaurant. Number two. Number two. My father teaches math at a university in our hometown. Number three. I now work downtown at a bank using software programs to manage their financial records. Number four, she carries a gun for protection as part of her job. Number five, the man will explain all of the historical sites on your trip. Number six, Maria works at a clothing store helping customers find what they need. Number seven. He'll stop near the next light and you can get off there. He'll stop at the next light and you can get off there. Number eight, the woman took my order, but the food hasn't come yet. Number nine, the man said that my car wouldn't be ready until tomorrow because he hasn't finished repairing the problem. The last one. Number 10. My sister enjoys working for the airlines, but traveling so much and assisting passengers all day on long flights can be tiring. All right. Now, yes, right? So let us see the way we uh, pronounce the words. Uh, Jessica Ramos, please. Number one. Mm. La primera, teacher. Yes, Jessica, the first. Hey. Hey. He. He. Hey. Real. No. Um, 
Esa letrita de la segunda, si no sé cómo se dice. Really? 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 Yeah. Really? yeah. Hey, really? Y you? Enjoys. Enjoy. Pre. No. Preparing. Me cuesta porque sí le entiendo a veces el español, pero me cuesta decir. Hey, preparing food. Me prepara preparé. Food. Ah. Uh, 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 at Italian. At it at Italian. Restaurant. Restaurant chef. That's a chef, right? Thank you, Jessica. Fatima, number two, please. Okay. My father teaches math at university in our home, uh, hometown. My father teaches math at a university in our hometown. Good. Number three, Carlos Josue. I know work, don't sound advanced using software program to the manager the financial financial records. Okay. I, now. I now I now work, work downtown at the bank using at a, software at a bank using software programs to the ma to manager to manage the the manage their financial records records number four edwin she cards are done for protection as part of her job good she carries a gun for protection as part of her job good uh esperanza number five the men will explain all, all the all of the historical sites on your trip. The man will explain all the historical sites on your trip. Good. Number six, Henry. Maria work work at uh, what Maria work at uh, uh, a flooring store helping customers feel what they need. Maria works. Henry. Maria works. Works at a clothing store helping customers find what they need, right? Thank you. Ladies? Yes. Number seven, yes. please. Okay. Help stop near the next light and you can get off there. He'll stop near the next light and you can get off there. Good. Number eight, Luis. Luis Reyes. Okay. Eight. The women to make order. Butley food and coming joy out. Yes. The woman took my the order. Do my order. Took my order, but the food uh, hasn't uh, come uh, yet. Come uh, out uh, yet. Yes. Thank you. Number nine, uh, let me see. I think Gabriela is missing, right, Gabriela? The man said that my car will be ready until tomorrow because Because I'm sorry. Finish, finish that. Repairing. Repairing the problem. 
The man said the my car wouldn't be ready until tomorrow because he hasn't finished repairing the problem. Good. And the last one, Jennifer Hernandez. My sister enjoys working for the airlines, but tri traveling so much and assisting <clears throat> all day on low, on long. Flings can be tidy. Lights can be tidy. Lights can, lights can be tidy. Can be tidy. Tidy. Can, can be tidy. Tidy. All right. Can be so tidy. This is this is a, a link that I that I uh, that I found out in the book. So let us do something. Since I want you to keep working in this part, okay, uh, I will share the link. You have it in the book, but you know, uh, uh, let me see. I will share with you. I will stop sharing here. Okay. Uh, teacher, una pregunta. Tell este, me. no, no va a compartir este esta dinámica para para poderla practicar. Yeah, eh, that's right. That's what uh, I will do now, eh, Luis. Allí en el uh, chat, yeah. ahí está el enlace, ¿ok? El enlace uh -huh. también lo encuentran en el libro. Uh, es bien uh -huh. significativo que ustedes. Uh -huh. Vaya, ahorita teníamos 10 oraciones, ¿verdad? Uh, hay cositas que no las pronunciamos bien, entonces hay que no hay que decir, bueno, ya pasamos este ejercicio, ya estuvo, ya nos olvidamos de él y continuamos con otra cosa. No, vamos a ir tratando de, de que, lo, lo que lo mucho o lo poco que aprendamos en la clase, que lo aprendamos bien. Por eso les comparto el enlace para que ustedes, eh, este fin de semana o en los tiempos que ustedes tengan eh, para practicar, pues que lo hagan. De manera que el lunes yo voy a preguntar, eh, o voy a pedir a algunos que me lean las 10 oraciones, ya no va a ser solo una, ok, voy a pedir a unos 3, unos 4 de ustedes que me lo lean y por supuesto eh, lo vamos a leer mejor, verdad, vamos a pronunciar mejor eh, ese, ese ejercicio se encuentra en, la, en, en el link de la página 19 let me see, I don't remember. Let, me see let me see let me see uh, Edwin mm. I think it was, let me see, conversation about two people took. Um, it's about, it says vocabulary. Don't remember if it was. It needs to be about the number 19, that's right. You you are right, Edwin. Okay, teacher, thanks. Okay. Anyways, I shared it in the I shared it in the in the in the link. All right. Okay, people. Uh, yesterday. I, I don't know if you remember, we, we were like solving these exercises, right? So, eso ya lo solucionamos el día de ayer, pero quiero que me lo, que me lo digan de manera eh, oral en este momento. ¿Cómo quedó ayer? Aquí ya, vi, ya visualizamos los errores, ¿verdad? Ok, now, vamos a ir preguntando este, nuevamente. Gabriela, ¿cómo? What's the, what is the correct sentence in the number one? We are marketing manager. Thank you. Carlos Josue, number two. She is not Margarita Marroquin. She is not Margarita Marroquin. Edwin de la Paz. Oh, sorry. Edwin de Paz, number three. Natalia and Sarai are the new supervisor. The new su supervisor. Eh, Esperanza. Mm, 
My boss is Jorge Sandoval. All right. Uh, then we have Henry. Henry, are you there? Well, let's start with somebody else. Uh, Jessica Ramos. Hello, people. Do you listen to me? Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Uh, okay. So, <laughs> pensé que me había desconectado. No oigo a nadie. Hey, uh, let me see. Let us see. No, well, Luis was not in the class yesterday. Carla, Carla, please. Number number five. Their secretary is not Laura Miranda. Their secretary is not Lo Laura Miranda. That's right. Pretty good. So this is what we did yesterday. Esto es lo que hicimos ayer. Nos quedó pendiente esta actividad. ¿Se, se recuerdan? Okay. Now. Ustedes van a hacer algunas preguntas y, y le van a preguntar a alguien en el grupo, ¿ok? Esa persona tiene la opción de responder de dos maneras nada más, ¿verdad? Porque estas son preguntas de sí o de no. Pero acuérdense, si van a decir sí, no solo se dice yes. Okay. Are you an architect? Se so, solo va a contestar yes. Uh -uh. Yes, I am. Or no, I am not. ¿Ok? Okay, just no questions. Now let, let's start. Uh, let's start. Vamos a ir viendo este. Okay, this this will be like volunteers. Volunteers. I need volunteers. Question number one. Are you doctor? Uh, okay, Edwin. Uh, who are you? Who are you asking the question? Uh, ¿A quién le está haciendo la pregunta? Menciona a un compañero y le hace la pregunta. Entonces, for example, Edwin, are you a doctor? Ah, ok, Edwin. Carlos Josué, are you a doctor? Ok, that's the way it is. Yes, I am. Oh, Carlos Josué is a doctor. Very good. Ok, Carlos Josué, continue, please. Second question. Is she Spanish? 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 Who? Uh, El Nilsson. Uh, okay, so you say, is she a Spanish? Is she that's, Spanish? That, that's the question, right? Okay, instead of saying she, you would say... Okay, okay, okay. okay. Is, she, is, she, is she Spanish? No, I mean, the question was all right. La pregunta estaba bien. So you say, is, is Esperanza Spanish, Ellen Nilsson? Ah, okay. Yeah, is she Spanish? Is Esperanza Spanish? You say, hey, Ellen Nilsson, hello. Do you know, uh, is Esperanza Spanish? Okay, Carlos, go ahead. Yes. Carlos, 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 ask the question once again to Ellen Nilsson. Hagámosle la pregunta nuevamente, Carlos, a Ellen Nilsson. Ellen Nilsson, ¿es she Spanish? Yes, she is Spanish. Yes, she is. Es español la esperanza. Oh, I didn't know. <laughs> no, I didn't. I didn't know esperanza was Spanish. <laughs> okay, but that's really nice. Okay, Ellen Nilsson, ask a question to anybody, please. Number three. Uh, Wendy, are you painting? Wendy, are you a painter? Yes. A painter. Wendy said, yes. Yes, you are. Okay, yes, I am. Wendy, continue, please. Number four. Carla. 
Okay. Hay question. I don't, I don't listen. Don't listen. Is Esperanza a lawyer? Esperanza a lawyer? No, she no, is. No, I'm not. Oh, Esperanza said, no, I am not. And Carla said, no, no she is. is. <laughs> Very good. Very good. Now, <laughs> Carla, once again. Hi. Is Francisco uh, uh, to, I have to, tengo que elegir a alguien. Yeah, somebody in the group. Mm, tu, tu esperanza. Ok, eh, esperanza. Esperanza, is Francisco uh, your boss? Is Francisco your boss? No, I'm not Francisco. No. No, so what would be the answer then? Now, Esperanza, is Francisco your boss? No. No. He... No, is no. No, he's no, he is, right? Or no, he's no, not. No, he's... no, he's not. Okay, that's the way it is. And number six, Esperanza, question to anybody in the group. Eh, Gabriela, are you studying English? Are you studying English, Gabriela? Yes. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. No, I <laughs> just, uh, yeah, okay, that's what I want you to notice over here is that. Por ejemplo, ya vamos a entrar al presente simple y lo que quiero que, que, que nos quede bien marcado es que cuando veamos preguntas de sí o no, no solo nos vamos a quedar con yes, no, no, sino que, por ejemplo, ahorita tenemos el verbo be. Entonces, si nos pregunta, are you a student? ¿Eres estudiante? Entonces usted va a decir, yes, I am. ¿Ok? Si va a decir no, no, I'm not. ¿Ok? Si le pregunta, are you an architect? ¿Eres arquitecto? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Y lo otro, si nos preguntan en tercera persona, ¿es Carla, es, ¿es Carla a teacher? ¿Es Carla una docente? The, yes, she is. Or no, she isn't. ¿Es el Nilsson a mechanic? ¿Es el Nilsson me un mecánico? Yes, he is. Or no, he isn't. All right? Uh, that's the way we complete the, the answers. Esa es una manera, la manera correcta de completar las oraciones, de manera oral y de manera escrita. All right, espero que lo hayan terminado esa parte. Y ahora sí, vamos con, con eh, más vocabulario, que es lo que nos compete hoy en la noche. Now, over here, we have, uh, well, we're, we're, we're going to talk about uh, job positions, we will continue talking about it, describing job positions and activities that people perform every day at work. That's what we're going to try to look for tonight. Okay, this is the goal. We will start by brainstorming about job positions at your workplace and say three activities you do there. Well, yesterday we were talking about this, right, about a job position and also about the activities we do in our job. Well, over here we have we're going to, um, you're going to listen to me. I will read the following job positions. Then you will match the, uh, the positions with the activities they perform. For example, well, you have bookkeeper, finance, financial analyst, human resource specialist, digital marketing manager, insurance agent, software engineer. Okay, I will give you two minutes or three minutes. Le doy tres minutos para que averigüen. Si acaso no hay, si hay alguno de estos que no conocen, que lo busquen ahorita en la red. Two minutes. Two or th three minutes would be enough, right? Si usted ya sabe que es el bookkeeper, ya no lo busque. Financial analyst, okay. 
human resource specialist, digital marketing manager, insurance agent, software engineer. Ya les voy a preguntar qué es cada uno de ellos. Okay, now I think you you have enough in, in, enough time, right? Hey, what is a, what is a a bookkeeper, people? Contable or contador? That's a bookkeeper. Contador. Okay. What's a financial analyst? Analista financiero. Analista financiero. What is a human resource specialist? Especialist in recursos humanos. Okay. What is a digital marketing manager? Director de mercadeo. Mercadeo. All right. Where is an insurance agent? Agente de seguros. Where is a software engineer? Ingeniero de sistemas. Okay, now. Let me see. Por ahí han dejado activado micrófonos. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Um, number one. Vamos a ir definiendo a uh, cada uno de ellos, okay? For example, in, in the number one, we have a uh, keep track of the financial accounts accompanied. What's the letter for it? A. A. That's letter A. That's letter A. Vayan solventándolo ahí ustedes. Number two, help people in businesses manage their finance, finances. B. B, financial analyst. B. Number three. E. Know the policies and regulations involve the management of employees. E. C. Human resource specialist. 
Sí. Y letter A. Me. Number four. Creating and advertise a company over social media. Digital sí. marketing manager. Digital D. marketing manager. D. D. That's letter D, right? D. Uh, help people and companies against financial loss and, and manage risks. Mm. Yeah. Human yeah. resource specialist. Yes. Eight. Say, see, see, right? Number six, design and develop different softwares. Software engineer. F. F. Okay, we will see the answers now. Okay, the first one. I will share with you in the chat. Now that's the way we got it. The number one bookkeeper, right? Number two, financial analyst. All right, number three, human resource a specialist good number four digital marketing marketing manager good number five insurance agent uh, oh here is where we have the problem right because uh, the number five is uh insurance agent right that's letter e over here Ah, había que ir ahí. Yeah, it's yeah. letter A. Uh, and the other one, software engineer. C and number number three. The number three would be C, that's right. All right, yeah. Yeah, it's, a C, yeah. Yeah, it's because it's, it's really nice to, uh, I mean, really important to clarify it because this would be like human resource specialist, okay? Is the one who knows the policies and regulations involved in the manage management of employees. And in the number um, in the number five, the person who helps people and companies against financial loss and manage risk is the insurance agent. Okay, so that's it, right? Now, Next, uh, yesterday I told you, right? To provide your name, your job position, and some other tasks that you do at, at work, okay? So over here we have one, two, three, four sp spaces for you to complete it. Now, let's see how many people do I have here? Have 14. This is a page 19, people. Es la página 19, es la que vamos a trabajar ahorita. So we'll create three groups. Vamos a hacer tres grupos, ¿ok? Y vamos a trabajar sobre ello. Ok, vamos a completar esa información. Luego yo voy a elegir a uno de, de cada grupo para que nos diga la información del, del resto de los compañeros, ¿ok? Richard, una pregunta. Este, siempre he tenido la duda ahí, ¿cómo es que se, se forman los grupos? Porque no puedo visualizar yo con quiénes me, me, me ha tocado trabajar. Eh, fíjese que esto lo hace de manera aleatoria, Edwin. Sí, correcto. Cuando, cuando usted, digamos, deja de transmitir, 
nos aparece con quiénes somos los que estamos trabajando. No, este, yo lo que hago es tomar una, una foto de, de cómo han quedado los grupos y después pregunto. Ok, ok, está bien. Gracias. Ok, okay Edwin. Ok, let us create the group. Vamos a crear los grupos y vamos a completar esa tarea. Ok, full English. Quiero escucharlo solo en inglés, por favor. Al final, recuérdense, este, voy a elegir una o dos personas que nos comenten acerca de la información que obtuvieron. Ok. Asegúrense que pues, si hay más de cuatro en el grupo, entonces tomen apuntes así este, en, un, en un cuadernito o algo para este, dar la información de todos. Ok. Here we go. for stamping graphic designer designer and other task is create art for stamping process and business and business catalog design business creo que es, creo que se dice. Business. Uh -huh. business business catalog design hello hola Uh, business catalog design 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 de de design de design ah diseño oh, design tal okay. vez en el en el chat no sé si se puede compartir design la información ah sí ahorita para poder escribirla mejor <risa> Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, I. Well, who is the other? What? What? Um, mm, well, my name is Ladies. Um, yo posis posisión es me main es el la posición en mi trabajo secretary um, other tasks otras tareas eh, Hello. bueno aquí lo hice <laughs> fuera de lo lo que hago de, de como de secretaria Sí. Sería a take care of my four months old daughter after work I prepare the food and clean the house lo voy a escribir en el, en el chat para que puedan Okay. Yo, yo también voy a escribir el para mío. ir avanzando. Ajá. Uh, okay, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Remember, you have to practice uh, all the information, okay? No sabemos a quién de ustedes dos, de, 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 perdón, a qué personas les va a tocar del grupo presentar la info, ¿ok? Okay. Other?
Henry? Hi. Uh, others? Ah, okay. Facilitate facilit equipment, organization, and train leaders. Organization and what? Excuse me. Uh, spelling, please. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, T R A. A M L E A D E R S. E I L E I D E R S. Okay, thank you. Gabriela. No, nosotros no nos parece. Aparece como privado. Uh -huh. Y ahí, ahí. El tuyo ya lo enviaste, José. A ahorita, ahorita. ¿Por qué? Ahí te lo envié, te cayó. Sí, correcto, ya lo vi, gracias. Bueno. bueno. ¿Cuál es otra tarea que se realiza aparte de eso, Jennifer? Eh... Decía este hombre que no me estoy ocupado. Ahí a, la, a, la, a, a Jennifer y a Jessica, ahí les escribí en, en privado. En, esto estoy revisando, pero no me cae nada. Ahí le tiene que salir como en más. No, a ver. Nada. Mm, no, solo me aparece su nombre, pero no me aparece nada. Ah, pues ahí, 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 ahí contésteme.
aquí le mando, aquí le tengo que mandar lo que yo, lo que sí. yo hice. Sí, sí, sí. Que sería su, su, su puesto de trabajo y, y, y lo que hace. Ok. Igual Jessica. Jennifer, yo perdón. Soy Jessica. Eh, Jennifer, de, perdón. De, 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 eh, ya se lo paso porque lo tenía, lo estaba haciendo yo al de otra persona. Ahorita le estoy poniendo, le voy a poner el mío yo. Le cayó Jessica como las actividades, las actividades que uno hace en el trabajo, entendí yo. Sí, eso es. Las actividades que uno ah, hace en el trabajo. Y yo al revés. <risa> <risa> como que otras actividades que uno hace. Ah, fuera del trabajo, pensó. Ajá, algo así. Ajá, sí, pensé. Sí. Bueno, no problem. Fatima Molina, job position is telemarketing and other tasks. No, don't say who is it, who is there. Other tasks, customer service. Customer service, okay. Customer service. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's good. And Luis, no say other tasks. Luis. No sé. Nothing. Vaya, nos quedan 60 segundos. Pero creo que de, de cinco son cuatro, vea. Sí. Creo que con cuatro sí. nos defendemos. Sí, cuatro, sí. Sí, como somos, bueno, ya casi vamos a salir. Y sí, ya queda poco. Ya tengo sueño. <risa> Y mañana trabajan. No, no. Qué dichosa. <risa> Dichosos. Yo sí. Triste. Eh, bueno, compañeras, eh, primeramente, ahí van a disculpar que estoy como un poco fuera de órbita. Eh, hasta hoy me voy incorporando, pero me pienso poner al corriente, ya que no, no había. Hello again, everyone. Now I could see that you were working really hard in the groups. Okay, that that was really nice to see you working and to listen to listen to what you were saying. It was really nice. Okay, so uh, you know we have like fifteen minutes, like twenty minutes more in a class. Okay, I will ask only one or two people from each group, and then uh, I will check the list attendance, and uh, the class will be over. Okay. From the group number one, I need uh, Fatima, uh, Fatima and, uh, and Carla. Both of you will participate, Fatima and Carla, from group number one. What can you tell us about the information you got in the group? About the information that I got in the group. About your classmates. <laughs> Well, um, my first person is Lady Cecibel. Uh, she jobs, her, her job position is a secretary. And the other task uh, is she take care of, of, my, of, my, of her four months 
old daughter, daughter after work, she prepared the food and cleaned her house. Okay, thank you. Okay, Fatima. I don't know, is Fatima here? No. Well, uh, if, if we don't have Fatima here, so let me see. Uh, ladies, please. Um, Carla Mendoza. Uh, your your job positions is graphic designer. Other task is create art for stamping process and business catalog design. That our teacher. Okay, thank you, ladies. Group number two, I want uh, Jennifer Hernandez and Esperanza. Um, Esperanza is college manager, is, 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 Strategic design, design for clients. Only. Only. Only that, all right. What about the deal participant? Mm, um, eh, también Gabriela Guardado. Okay. Commercial anal analyst. Great assessment opportunities in supermarkets. In supermarkets. Supermarket. And Henry, coordination of the church and communities. Train leaders, um, facilitate equipment como equipo creo sí solo es okay thank you very much okay we will listen to, to only to one person in the next group okay Carlos Josué group number three hello hello I'm sorry man. let me see the name is Edwin De Paz, job position, shopping supervisor, head on the train staff. That's it. The other people no no understand and don't listen. You I did, don't listen. She didn't listen. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't I don't know if there is anybody else in the group. Maybe Edwin the pass. Edwin, okay. Edwin. Okay. Uh um, um Carlos Sue. Management and server custom, job occupation. Another task, uh, businessman. Uh, Jennifer Rivas, job position, assistant production. Other tasks, toting and packaging of chips. Jessica Ramos, uh, delivery of production in the super selectors and life. Only that. Fantastic. Hey, congrats, people. 
I can see that you, you can uh, perfectly work in, in groups. Okay, ya veo que cada día trabajan mejor en, en grupos. Uh, let me see. Por ahí en el WhatsApp, yo les dejé una página para que la completen. It's the job, uh, I mean, it's, a, it's about a professions. Es una, un documento Word que de, deben completar. Por favor, les pido que eh, lo completen y que el día de mañana, pues, o ahora mismo en la noche, que completen también el ejercicio de la plataforma. ¿Ok? Esos dos ejercicios. Eh, antes de... Bueno, voy a pasar lista y ya luego les digo, por ahí les voy a dejar algo en el chat que, que necesito que averigüen para la otra semana. Teacher. Hello. Una pregunta. El documento que usted mandó. Yo no tengo computadora, sino que eh, estoy con el teléfono. Pero eh, quizás por el tipo de documento no, me, no se me abre. No le abre. Ah, no, quizás es porque no es PDF. No puedo utilizar el Word. Todo lo que han mandado en Word no lo puedo abrir. Ajá, porque no es PDF. Haga, hagamos una cosa. Si alguien, si alguien nos hace el favor de tomarle foto al ejercicio y compartirlo en el grupo, se los voy a agradecer. Yo lo haría con, con mucho gusto sí, ahorita. O, o, o compartirlo en PDF. Tal o, ahí lo... o tal vez nos hace... PDF, hacen... sí. Porque sí. yo, lo, yo, lo puedo, yo lo puedo abrir, pero se desconfigura todo, porque como está en documento de Word, ¿verdad? entonces, Ajá. Pero, pero que en PDF sería mejor, así no se desconfigura nada tampoco. De lo... Ok, este, ¿Cómo? bueno, eh, lo voy sí, a hacer. Sería bueno, ¿De sería qué bueno porque es, igual yo no, yo por medio de teléfono no, no tengo. Bueno. Ah, ok, lo vamos a convertir entonces en PDF, tal vez si a alguien le queda tiempo ahorita y si no, pues lo hago yo más noche, no hay problema. Yo ya lo abrí, ya veo las imágenes. Okay. Puede ver si lo exporto. Ok. Es un, es, solamente es una página, ¿verdad, teacher? Sí, solamente es una página. Sí, solo es, ah, solo pues solo convertirlo, solo es convertirlo en PDF y sí. que lo envíe otra vez a WhatsApp. Okay. Así no tengamos problemas los que tenemos el teléfono. Usamos okay. el teléfono, ¿no? Este, una, una también pregunta. ¿En qué grupo de WhatsApp están trabajando? Porque, bueno, lo personal no, no me ha caído nada ahorita. Este, por ahí le, le enviaron este, la información a su correo y en el, en el correo que le enviaron, ahí está el enlace del grupo. Y le dice, vamos a pasar lista. Carlos Josué. Present teacher. Denise Elizabeth. Denise. Edgardo Daniel. Perdón, ahí lo puse. Denise. Uh, thank you. Thank you. So Denise no se encuentra en el grupo. Edgardo. Thank you. Edgardo Daniel. Okay. Edgardo, Edwin Osvaldo, present teacher, Ellen Nilsson, present teacher, present, ok, Esperanza, mm -hmm. present, Evelyn Yanira, hello Evelyn, Fátima Michel. Present. Gabriela Jazmín. Present. Henry Giovanni. Present, teacher. Jennifer Guadalupe. Present, teacher. Juan Carlos Beltrán. Juan Carlos Beltrán. Julio César. Carla María. Present teacher. Lady Cecibel. Present teacher. Ok. Luis José. Obed Eleazar. 
Wendy Carolina. Present, teacher. William Aristides. William. Jennifer Madali. Here. Jessica Noemi. I, I saw Jessica, what's going on? Jessica, are you there? Present. Okay, so that, that's better. Okay, um, personas que no visualicé en la clase y no me respondieron, Denise, Elizabeth, Edgardo, Daniel, Evelyn, Yanira. No me recuerdo si, bueno, Evelyn, Yanira. Carlos, Juan Carlos Beltrán, Julio César, and William Arises. That's it. Okay. Um, let me see. ¿Pudo alguien compartir el documento en PDF? Yes. Okay, very good. Let me see. Ah, sí, aquí está. Charlotte. Este, teacher. Tell me. Este, fíjense de que estaba viendo yo ahí en el correo y, y al parecer me pide una contraseña para ingresar sesión, me dice. Y es... Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, eh. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Ok, now, uh, ya para ir finalizando... Si ustedes se dieron cuenta, esta noche estuvimos mucho con vocabulario. De hecho, pues, llevan varias actividades por ahí. Una de ellas es que quiero que creen su álbum de profesiones y ocupaciones. Eso fue lo primero, ¿verdad? Que por cada uno de, de nosotros acá en el grupo, pues, que, que, que aporten tres profesiones, ya sean profesiones o ocupaciones, en donde se explique Uh, qué es lo que hace cada, cada persona. ¿Da? De modo que el día lunes ya tengamos un álbum o un documento con por lo menos 40, y 40 digamos, 40 profesiones y ocupaciones. ¿okay? Eh, si acaso, pues, mmm, no se logran completar las 40, pues, o tratemos de obtener las, la mayoría que las, podamos. ¿okay? La, las serían las 40 ocupaciones más sus funciones. Exacto. O solo. Okay. Exacto, más la función de, de cada uno, ¿verdad? Que es lo que hacen. De, de tal manera que no solo nos vamos a quedar con la profesión o la ocupación, sino que también vamos a, a, a tratar de alcanzar más información, aprender más información a través de, de, de explicar las funciones o de ver qué funciones tienen cada uno de ellos. Eso es lo primero. ¿Este álbum sería para el día lunes? O sí, para, qué? para lunes, para lunes, para lunes. 40. Eh, sí, 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 sí. <risa> ah, Eso está sería que, un documento. Yo creo que escuché mal. <risa> sí, sí, 40. Un documento así. Este... Sí, un documento Word. Documento, ah, okay. documento Word. Acuérdense que ah, hoy, sí. estamos, hoy estamos a, a, ¿qué? a, a un clic de encontrar esas 40 esas 40 profesiones y esas 40 ocupaciones. O sea, ya luego solo le da a usted copiar, pegar y leer y ya pues, eh, ya casi que todo está cocinado hoy con el internet. ¿no? Este, lo otro es esa paginita, ese documento PDF, que, que me lo trabajen, porfa, porque también este, voy a solicitar de su apoyo para, para ver cómo lo completaron el día lunes. ¿Ese lo compartieron en el WhatsApp o en el, el que está en WhatsApp, WhatsApp Edwin? El, que okay. está en el PDF, Perfect. porque ahí sí no se distorsiona la información. Y lo último, Perfect. que ya me va a servir y nos va a servir a todos para este, empezar a hablar de un nuevo tema, me van a, inves o me van a investigar, me van a explicar cómo es una, una semana típica en su vida. ¿Qué es lo que ustedes hacen en una semana común y corriente en sus vidas? Pero aparte, por ejemplo, de, 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 por ejemplo alto, o qué alto. me levanto a las seis, a las cinco, luego ah, pues okay. voy, me tomo un baño, después del baño ah, pues, okay. me tomo el desayuno, a tales horas voy al trabajo, regreso a tales horas, todo eso, 
es, es, son como las actividades más significativas que ustedes hacen durante la semana. Pero aparte de eso, eh, me van a hablar de su mejor amigo. De cómo es una semana típica uh, de su mejor amigo. No lo veo con mi mejor amigo. O, de, o de su mejor amiga. Si, si es su mejor amigo, yo creo que sí se saben qué es lo que hace durante... Porque es el mejor amigo, o sea... Cuando, Pero no lo cuando, veo. Cuando, cuando, hablamos del, <risa> cuando hablamos del mejor amigo, creo que wow, ya uno ya sabe, el mejor amigo va a tal lugar, trabaja en tal lugar, se levanta a tales horas, o sea, uno ya se sabe... Casi, casi que toda la rutina del mejor amigo. Por eso elegí el mejor amigo o la mejor amiga, para que ustedes estén seguros de, de la rutina de esa persona. Un daily routine. Yeah. Una, yeah, a typical week like. Una, 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 ¿Cómo es una rutina de semana, digamos? Por la suya y, de, y la de su mejor amigo. En inglés. Okay. Teacher, no, 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 no he podido ingresar al WhatsApp, al igual no, no ha caído el PDF. No, ¿En serio? No tengo la información. Y en, el chat, y en el chat de acá de, de, de Zoom, no lo pueden enviar. Uh, hagan, háganme el favor, alguno de ustedes, porfa, lo, los que tienen el enlace, ¿por qué? Quiero ver si a mí me llega también en el documento que me envían. Listo, tienden, Ahorita, Luis, creo que aquí está, que aquí lo tengo. Grupo de WhatsApp. Ahorita lo comparto. Ok, Pregunta, Luis. Pregunta, teacher, esa, esa paginita, eh, hoy tenemos que terminarla, dijo, ¿verdad? Mm, es para el lunes, ¿verdad? Si usted la puede ah, completar. Pero... Lo que sí les voy a solicitar que sí terminen lo de la plataforma, porque acuérdense ah. que eso sí es como lo, lo, eso sí es de rigor, o sea, la plataforma es, eso llega a Insafor, eso está con nosotros acá en inglés corporativo, porque okay, ya lo que yo les voy asignando, por ejemplo, lo, de, lo del file de ahora y, y lo del typical week like, eso ya son actividades que yo asigno, o sea, o sea, es, o sea yo las reviso como docente directamente, pero eso no queda registrado en Insafor, ¿verdad? queda registrado nada más en los videos que, que nosotros creamos acá. Lo del pero, libro. Ah, igual, lo del libro hay que, hay que trabajarlo. Uh -huh. Ok, así que pues estamos bendecidos con, con tareas y espero verlos el día lunes. Eh, me encanta poder estar con ustedes. Eh, siempre les, les animo a seguir adelante. Eh, que se preparen su tacita de café o un té eh, les recomiendo también que tomen un baño antes de, de entrar a la sesión para que estemos siempre activos ok uh, it's been a pleasure and uh, I hope to see you soon God bless you ok teacher thank you bye thank you so much teacher solo una consulta Tell me, Gabriela. Eh, ¿Qué tarea sería la 4 en la plataforma? Uh, let me see. Quiero estar seguro. No, creo que es otra. Ahorita la veo. Es la, sí, la, 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 la sería. sería la... No, la 5. Bueno, si acaso no ha terminado la 4, porque eso... <coughs> ah, ayer no hicimos la 4 acá en, 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 en el grupo, ¿verdad? Entonces, no, sería la 4 y la 5. Cuatro y cinco, por favor. Okay. A, a modo okay. de terminar hasta las cinco. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. See you. See you. See you. Good night. See you. Good night.